how do you feel like the guys were able to kind of refocus and, um, you know, handle all the stress of what happened before the game, you know, while they were playing today? Yeah, I thought, you know, come, come game time, I thought everybody was, you know, focused. I thought we competed well. Um, you know, it was one of those nights. I thought, you know, you, you rarely get beat with solo homers, um, you know, especially in this big, big ballpark. Uh, and tonight, you know, you got to give credit to uh, the, the Orioles. They, they hit five of them. Um, and, uh, you know, we didn't walk anybody. We were, we were aggressive in the zone. We made some plays defensively and, and offensively. I thought we battled well. Um, you know, we, we, we probably got into trouble. We had some leadoff guys on or had some guys on base and, and a couple double plays there, you know, took us out of some innings. But I thought overall we competed well and, and played hard. It is just as a whole, um, from, you know, the good taking two or three in Tampa, Jose Miranda's debut to, you know, the COVID stuff and all that. What has kind of this whole road trip, you know, been like, I guess, from your perspective? I still think it's a that? positive trip. And I, I definitely think it's a positive trip. You come out of there with the winning record. Of course, after getting the first two here in Baltimore, um, you know, we're, we, we, we were uh, gunning for the one today. We wanted to win the series. Uh, but with that being said, um, we're excited to get back home, get back home to Minnesota and, and get back to our home crowd. Uh, so we're going to get on the plane tonight. We're going to regroup, uh, probably going to be showing up at the field uh, because of the night game tonight and travel. We're going to be a little bit later and and uh, get ready to go and, and, and take on Oakland. How is um, Carlos doing? So the trainers um, you know, took a look at his finger right now. Um, they're calling it uh, a contusion. Um, as we fly back to Minnesota tonight, um, uh, he's going to go get a CT scan tomorrow. And so tomorrow uh, we should have more information on it. Do you, do you know what, which finger? I, I, I don't. Um, he took his, his batting glove off and, and uh, the trainers had him uh, down there. And then earlier, uh, I think the, the, the at bat earlier, uh, where he got hit, it was hand to shoulder. So he took a, a shot there, but I think um, on the, the ball that he hit back to the pitchers, the, it, it, I think it was the, the middle finger. Um, and, and he was back uh, down there and, and, and running some tests and, and trying to squeeze a hand. Um, and, and he was in a lot of pain. Is that his left hand to you? I, I can't tell you right now off the, off the top of my head. I, I, I don't know. Jace, both of those hit by pitches seem to come on check swings from Carlos. Uh, was the ball especially difficult to pick up tonight for some guys, do you think? You know, I think especially, you know, early on uh, with, with, with Watkins, um, you know, he's, he, he's got a little run on his fastball, but I think he was starting a lot of those kind of cutters, kind of front hip. Um, and then I know as we got into their bullpen, uh, they had a lot of guys that, They've got really good arms and uh, the ball's moving a couple different directions. And I think the guy um, that, that Carlos did that check swing, um, he's got a two seamer that runs in hard and then he's got a little slider off of it and, and he tunnels it really well. So um, I think you got to give credit to uh, the Orioles pitching. They've got some good young arms and, and they did a good job tonight.